Welcome to CBS This Morning. A potentially historic winter storm is barreling towards the northeast. Blizzard warnings extend for 250 miles this morning from South Jersey to down East Maine. Nearly 30 million people could be hit with two feet or more of snow. New York and Boston are in the bullseye. Right now, the storm is gaining strength after racing across the Midwest. Several cities could see wind gusts get this over 50 miles an hour. It has been snowing all night in Ohio and Pennsylvania. Jerika Duncan is in Jersey City, New Jersey, just outside Manhattan, where road crews are getting ready. Jerika, good morning. Good morning, and some of those flurries just started coming down here in Jersey City. But the real work starts at facilities like this one, where thousands of tons of salt will be dumped into trucks and plows responsible for one of the difficult jobs in all of this, and that is keeping the roads safe. The storm made its mark on central Ohio overnight, creating dangerous conditions that left cars spinning their wheels, a preview of what's in store for the Northeast. This could be the biggest snowstorm in the history of the city. On Sunday, you know, New York City up. Mayor Bill de Blasio urged New Yorkers to prepare for the worst. Don't underestimate this storm. Assume conditions will be unsafe. Big snowstorm. The last time Manhattan saw an upwards of 24 inches of snow was in 2006. Nearly 2,000 plows and 126,000 tons of salt are on standby. In Massachusetts, hurricane force winds are expected to accompany the two feet of snow, prompting one person in this seaside town of Situate to board up his home. In a statement, Boston Mayor Marty Walsh said, be vigilant, stay inside and off the roads, and remember to check on your neighbors. After receiving a few inches over the weekend, officials in Pennsylvania say they are fully equipped to handle the blizzard that may blanket their state. Everybody is doing their best to prepare for this, and I think uh, uh, we're, we're ready for action. And airlines have canceled many flights already, and United recently announced that it plans to cancel all its flights at airports in, New in Newark, LaGuardia, Boston, and also at JFK. They're canceling all those flights on Tuesday. Gail? Mm, sounds like we need to pack our patients. Thank you, Jerika.